Okay, hello everyone. Hi, it's Abby, and today I am. I started the day with an apple first, and then I'm having my lemon water because I just the lemon water wasn't convenient at the moment. I know it's really simple. It seems like a simple thing, but I had an apple handy, and I just wanted to eat something really fast. So uh, I'm gonna have that, and um, unfortunately, I'm probably gonna have some kale chips today. Um, I have a coupon at Sprouts. Kale chips are $3.99. They're Brad's Cool Ranch. Um, don't ask me about the fat content. I don't think it's terribly high, but it, there's fat in it. So um, yeah, I'm consciously going forward today with that. But my fat intake before I is, is so dramatically reduced before I even started dealing with medical medium, you know, trying to go forward with his program, not able to, at the moment, do it the way I want to. In the near future, I'm hoping to. We'll see. But my, my fat, like, like, I can't even tell you the fat reduction. Just, just be being consciously aware. And I'm really thinking about, okay, like, I'm really thinking about why? Why is it a bad idea to have fat in your diet? Now, Anthony William talks about, I remember just from listening to the podcast that all of us have heavy, heavy metals in our bodies. Certain people, a lot of people have a hard time detoxifying. Um, and for various reasons, they have a lot more um, heavy metals in, in their bodies, in their heads, in their brains. When you eat a high fat, when you eat fat in your diet, over it fat, over it fats, is that how you say it? So these are things like you know, olive oil or just like innocent little things that you normally would have in your food, um, a lot more in processed or restaurant food. Um, it, the oil oxidizes metals. And this is going on in your brain and then they like flow the metals flow like you would see like in a stream something like a piece of metal you know how you see unfortunately you see these like outside you see metal say in someone's yard like an old car it's got metal and it's rusting it's oxidizing and then the it drips onto the grass so wherever it's dripping like it's not good and it's I don't think it's very good that that's kind of like happening in your brain so then what happens is you might have different symptoms based on your particular like I I unfortunately <laughs> I get really anxious and um, uptight and irritable and yeah so I have to go because my daughter's coming and I'll make another video